Hey, it's Sam here. Welcome to this demo of Clip Magics. This is a brand new cloud-based software that lets you find videos off YouTube or ones that you upload yourself or from the library and let you edit them into something unique. Okay, the benefit of the YouTube ones is you can go about finding any video that you are able to have the rights to and be able to customize it and use it, say, in your marketing or on your website. You can also upload your own videos or get videos from the library, uh, meaning you can use these with no worries. Now, one of the main features of this is the ability to be able to create cinemagraphs. Those are the sorts of videos where a certain element is still and other elements are moving. These are very, very popular for video ads. This makes it very uh, easy to create those as well. On top of that, you can add calls to action, other customized uh, items and things like that to really make the video your own to be able to create uh, it into whatever you want. So let's go uh, have a look here. This is the dashboard, okay? As you can see on YouTube, I can enter a keyword uh, and put it in, or I can upload a file or get something from the video library. So uh, in the video library, if I click get, you can see there's a bunch of different categories. I can go about choosing uh, a category, uh, find a video I want to use, say for example this one here. I can click play to be able to preview it and you can see it's got uh, it's got trains going on the bridge, it's got the water moving underneath and the sky is moving. So this would be quite a good one to uh, edit up uh, for the purposes of this demo. Uh, so that is basically the sorts of videos you can go about finding uh, stock footage. YouTube, if I go in here and I just write, let's show the YouTube side of things as well. If I write uh, sunrise time lapse and I click enter, it's going to give me a whole bunch of different, uh, different videos of sunrises coming up as well. So we've got this one here just to show you what you can do with this YouTube one. If I click on this, it shows the video uh, and it shows what it's doing. It's got the lake moving here. It's got some smoke coming on the top right as well, uh, but we can see the sun is going to start coming up. The sun doesn't start coming up until a certain time, so what I can do is I can make the start time at 9 seconds, and we'll make the end time at 20 seconds. Let's just choose this video for this demo. Now that's going to load up the video uh, directly from YouTube into our video editor. From here we're able to edit it, and you can see already on the left it's uh, got some of the uh, different ad call to actions and things like that that we can add in. So this has loaded it up already. Uh, I haven't edited this for any loading times or anything. This is just the the video is the video. So if I go mask, I can uh, go about masking uh, the part that I want to move. So if I want to keep this lake steady, I can go about going like this and animating up the sky. Okay, so you can see it's done that. I can click a wider path to be able to make a bigger part to be able to select it so I can uh, mask it much quicker. So as you can see, it's doing the sky side of things uh, and it's got the sun rising in the sky. Okay, I can make this a bit smaller using this path width bit down the bottom just for more precise clipping around there as well. Now if I'm happy with that, I can go about adding different things in there so I can uh, put in different overlays if I choose. Uh, we can see we've got different effects, things like that that can go onto the go onto the page. Uh, we've got different social icons as well. So I can go about putting different social icons in uh, to be able to use. So if I click on the random Skype icon, okay. Um, oops, I'm still in the mask section. So I'll go undo and I get out of the mask section. I can drag and drop and move this as I want. I can go about changing the size of this. Uh, I can go about changing the opacity. So if I want to make it a bit more see-through, uh, I can do those sorts of things as well. Offsets, blurring, uh, all those, all the sorts of things you would expect to be able to to be able to do. Now I can go about adding text as well. So I can just say uh, go like this in the text. I write, "Hey, cool text." Okay, uh, all sorts of different things. Effects, if we go up into the effects panel here, if I select this, click effects, you can see it does the effects for the text as well. Okay, I can import my own images or upload my own images. Uh, if we go back into the elements, I can put, yeah, like buy buttons, uh, different sorts of things. Even the lighting is uh, quite interesting. They've got like little uh, lighting bits that you can select. So here they are, the, the loading up, so we can shine a light down on something uh, up here, as you can see, and you can change the size, the width, all those sorts of bits and pieces as you would expect. So lots of different things you can do with this. Uh, I'm not going to go through all the options because it's pretty obvious what it does. Once you're pretty happy with that, you just click render, and then what you can do 
is you can actually have this, uh, you can either download this, so this has rendered it up already. I can either download this just by clicking download and use it in my ads or whatever I want. I can either type a message in here and specify a link, and then if I have my Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn, or YouTube account synced up, this can post it to these social networks for us as well, so we can schedule the post to go out at a certain time. So that's basically what you can do with Clip Magics. It's pretty cool, pretty simple, yet very effective. Uh, be very good for creating video ads, uh, especially with the cinemagraph style ads as well. So I encourage you to check it out on the bonus page down below for more information about this. Uh, get it during the early bird to get it at the best price. This is Sam. It's been my pleasure to show you through Clip Magics here today.